Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? What? 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 What's so funny? I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like zombies, aliens, time hopping Draculas. All right. So welcome back to more of the Corey. We last left off. We had just met Laura, found out all the traumatizing shit she had just been through. And so now she's telling the rest of them exactly what the fuck's going on. Uh, if you like this series, leave a like on this video. I'd really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, let's get, more, let's get more to the video. So, aggressive or calm. You want answers, Ryan? Shut the fuck. She should put him in check. Let's put him in check. All right, that might change the path, though. Ryan do be trying to be like, he be trying to be hella assertive, low key. Let's go with aggressive. Ryan, right? Yeah. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, let her finish, man. Would it yeah. really be so crazy? Check mark. With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick, with the thing on the roof, okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. There's more to all this than you think. Just let me finish, and you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Mm. She did she just show I think she just showed him. The next few her weeks arm. were long. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT. Tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. I love that he's, she's so like, try to get this guy on our side. what, so he'll let us go? She's so like, hard-headed. We uh, well, right now, now anyway. Okay, so let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch and mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know. I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. Uh, escape is the only way. 
I think we should try. I think we should I think try. We should try. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. So what's he waiting for? Look, we just... If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. So... Alright, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's gotta have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Hey, hey! T-Money! Can I call you T-Money? Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? Like, as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, team. At least he's bringing them food. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. Really, we've been awful. I don't know. I feel like I should keep keep the. You're right. The sarcasticness, the fake, fake nice really going. Make it up to you. Oh, I see what you're doing. What's well, not gonna work? You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here? Not gonna happen. Asshole. Max. We know what's going on! We know Max is a werewolf! Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Oh, that should have been confirmation right there. That's all I would have needed to see. I said, take your fucking clothes off! Fuck off! Get back! Max, what's going on? <laughs> Get the fuck away from him! Come here. Uh-oh. Get off of me! Shut up. Have a seat. Ah! Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not gonna believe it until you see it for yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. G, come in. What's your position? Over. Shit. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. I'm not gonna call her out because down to twenty. Over. That's literally it's his happened. his fucking like friend or whatever. Well, I'll tell you, it's not gonna be pretty. But don't worry, I'll be back at dawn. You're really gonna leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. Okay. Clinical, tell me what you're feeling. Compassionate, I'm here. I feel like she should just be compassionate because he has no control over it for one. And he might be in a lot of pain. Don't worry, Max. I'm here. 
Yeah. Yeah, right. Are you all right? Uh, yeah. I don't know. I just don't feel so good. Um, what do you need? What can I do to help? I was just hot. Are you hot? Well, I'm kind of stuck next to this big-ass pipe, so I'm not exactly cool. Just stay back, okay? You shouldn't be this close. There's not a lot I can do about that right now. Max? Max? Tell me what's going on! He is a... What is that? Is it a, is it a scratch or is it just... Or is it just the bite? So the bite turns you. So much for depth perception. The scratch does not. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. So, I'm thinking, I wonder, uh, I kind of want to go look. Can I look? Oh, no, I guess the fog. I guess, I guess the fog won't let me look. All right, so there's the bathroom. That's where she just came out of. Okay. So you you guys know me. You guys know I'm looking for a card. You guys know I'm looking for a card. Let's see. Nothing in the bathroom. So she, she said that he's been... Letting them take showers, which is a good thing. So at least they get to... Do all that. Let's see. We got... What do we got here? Okay, so that door is locked. So we know... We know Max is the werewolf. Is one of the werewolves. What's he hiding? Everybody's got secrets, man. Everybody's got secrets. Can I go up this way? Okay, so we've got... What are you hiding, Travis? 
Cease and desist letter. So she can be in, she can be in here. Anne Radcliffe and Edward Benson. Wonder who they are. Okay, I'm gonna go to the other side. If I was a card, where would I be? Hello? She's not gonna guess the password. I'm not gonna guess the password. Not so much a hint as a slap in the face. Now, what do you bet? We keep snooping around. We find his birthday, and we come back down here. The whole, like, thing, it's like just doing too much down there is kind of freaking me out. If I get beat up, I'm gonna just have to get beat up. Fuck. I'm gonna need to rest soon. Huh. Mama's boy. Fifty six. That means he was born in nineteen sixty five. So he was born in nineteen sixty five. Okay, okay, so we got clues. What's in here? Give me a card, please. July seventh, nineteen fifty six. Should have figured out my man's birthday. Hey, what was that? No, not that X. All right, so now we can go back into the room and look at the computer. All right. Let's see what happens when I do it. Max breaks free. Then I'm at the fucking hide. I need to lie down. We want to know.
Yeah. hikers at all but ghost hunters who went in search of answers and fell victim to the mercy of the hag of Hackett's quarry never to be seen again like us except for the fell victim to the mercy of the blah 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 blah, blah part we're, we're more like um ghost investigators specter sleuths sure so what happened next well according to reports from the local paper the north kill gazette some hay bales caught fire during the opening night, and that spread pretty quickly. Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke, including the show's leading lady and her alleged baby. Oh, that's weird. That is so weird. That's so weird. All right, it's time for me to head back to the crib. All right. All right, Max, don't eat me. I'm coming back to to the crib. I'm gonna be honest with you. If I didn't know that he was already back here, like in the cage, like if I was just coming back here, say like it's Ryan or something, I'd be scared shitless. exhausted this and myself I need to sleep go to sleep I found everything Tell me what happened. I could ask you the same thing. Why didn't you run? Determined I won't leave Max. I won't leave Max. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me too. Happy? some coffee what's this an education watch all right, so like, comment, subscribe, I'll see you at the end of every video. When we come back next time, we will see what this cop has to say. We will see what this cop has to say. Tired of his, I'm tired of his interrogations. You see, Laura done got hurt. My boy, what? My boy, my boy, Max is werewolf. Anyway, see you guys next video. Peace.